Get ready to experience nature's raw power like never before. Here are 15 natural disasters that will leave you on the edge of your seat. Starting off the list with number one, 2023 Maui wildfires, Hawaii, USA. August 2023 will forever be a heartbreaking chapter in Maui's history. Wildfires driven by intense winds from Hurricane Dora ripped across the island with terrifying speed, leaving the historic town of Lahaina in ruins. Families had mere minutes to flee as flames swallowed homes, businesses and centuries-old landmarks. Over 100 lives were tragically lost and thousands were left without anything but the clothes they wore. Lahaina, once a lively symbol of Hawaii's rich culture, was reduced to a ghost town overnight. The emotional weight on survivors was crushing, not just because of the physical losses, but because they lost pieces of their identity and history. The fires didn't just scorch land, they scarred hearts. Though rebuilding began almost immediately, the road to healing is long and uncertain. At number two, we have another crazy footage that brought destruction in Central America. I'm talking about 2020 hurricanes in Eta and Iota. In November 2020, Central America was hit by a devastating one-two punch. Hurricanes Eta and Iota striking just two weeks apart. Both storms unleashed catastrophic winds, relentless rain, and deadly floods across countries like Honduras, Guatemala, and Nicaragua. Entire villages were submerged, crops were wiped out, and landslides swallowed homes without warning. For communities already grappling with poverty and the pandemic, the hurricanes were a brutal blow. Thousands lost everything, homes, livelihoods, even family members. Shelters overflowed, clean water became scarce, and desperation hung heavy in the air. Recovery efforts were quickly overwhelmed by the sheer scale of destruction. For many, rebuilding seemed like a distant dream. But what happens when a state built on rivers, lush landscapes and vibrant communities is suddenly swallowed by water? Moving on to number three, Kerala Flood, 2018. In August 2018, Kerala experienced exactly that. After days of relentless rainfall, rivers overflowed and floodwaters surged, tearing through villages and towns with terrifying force. The flood came fast, and it came hard. Entire homes were washed away, and more than 400 lives were lost, leaving families stranded and entire neighborhoods submerged. With over a million people displaced, Kerala was plunged into a race against time for survival. Streets turned into rivers, homes were reduced to ruins, and what once felt like paradise was left a mess of devastation. But that's not the only natural disaster that happened in 2018. Off to number four, it's 2018, Sulawesi earthquake and tsunami, Indonesia. On September 28, 2018, Indonesia's Sulawesi Island was rocked by a powerful 7.5 magnitude earthquake, and within minutes, a devastating tsunami crashed into its shores. The double disaster hit hardest in the city of Palu, where towering waves wiped out homes, roads, and entire neighborhoods. Over 4,300 people were killed, and thousands more were left missing or injured. Families were torn apart in an instant and the scenes of destruction were almost too overwhelming to process. Buildings crumbled like sandcastles, and communities vanished overnight. Liquefaction, where the ground literally turned into a thick, flowing mud, swallowed entire villages. Rescue efforts were heroic but heart-wrenching, as survivors dug with bare hands to find loved ones. The disaster exposed gaps in early warning systems and sparked a global outpouring of aid and support. Even today, Sulawesi carries the heavy scars of that day, both on its land and in its people. Next at number five, 2018 California Campfire. In November 2018, California lived through a nightmare no one will ever forget, the campfire. It started with a spark from faulty electrical equipment, and within hours, the fire ripped across Butte County like a runaway train. The town of Paradise was hit the hardest, and in a cruel twist, it was anything but Paradise that day. Over 85 people lost their lives, and thousands had to leave everything behind, often with just minutes to escape. Entire neighborhoods turned into fields of ash almost overnight. Survivors talked about driving through walls of smoke and flames, not knowing if they'd make it out. The emotional damage was just as heavy as the physical destruction. At number six, 
2023 Cyclone Freddy, Africa. Cyclone Freddy made history in 2023, but not the kind anyone would wish for. Lasting over a month, Freddy tore across southeastern Africa, hammering countries like Madagascar, Mozambique, and Malawi. It wasn't just the length of the storm that was shocking, it was the relentless devastation it left behind. Winds howled, floods swallowed entire villages, and landslides buried homes under walls of mud. In Malawi alone, more than 1,400 people lost their lives, with thousands injured or missing. Families watched helplessly as their homes and crops disappeared overnight, and communities already struggling with poverty faced even deeper crises. Now at number 7, 2020 Beirut Explosion. August 4, 2020 is a day Beirut will never forget. It started like any other afternoon, and then, in an instant, everything changed. A massive explosion rocked the city's port area after nearly 3,000 tons of improperly stored ammonium nitrate ignited. The blast was so powerful, it flattened entire neighborhoods, shattered windows miles away, and left a giant crater where the port once stood. Over 200 people lost their lives, thousands were injured, and hundreds of thousands found themselves homeless in a matter of seconds. Videos of the explosion flooded the internet, but even they couldn't capture the full horror of what Beirut's people lived through. Anger and heartbreak filled the streets as survivors demanded answers and accountability. The Beirut explosion wasn't just a tragic accident. It felt like a deep betrayal by a system that was supposed to protect them. Next, at number 8, 2023, Turkey-Syria earthquake. February 6th, 2023, started with pure devastation. In the early morning hours, a massive 7.8 magnitude earthquake ripped through southern Turkey and northern Syria, catching millions off guard while they were still asleep. Entire apartment blocks crumbled like sand, streets split apart, and the bitter cold made survival even harder. Over 50,000 lives were lost across both countries, and countless others were trapped under the rubble, waiting for help that sometimes came too late. In Syria, already worn down by years of war, the disaster piled onto an already unbearable situation. Moving on to number 9, 2005 Hurricane Katrina. August 29, 2005 is a date that still haunts the United States, especially New Orleans. Hurricane Katrina slammed into the Gulf Coast as a Category 3 storm, but it wasn't just the winds that caused devastation. When the levees broke, entire neighborhoods in New Orleans were swallowed by floodwaters. Families were stranded on rooftops, desperately waiting for rescue in the scorching heat. Over 1,800 people lost their lives, and thousands more were left homeless, their lives completely turned upside down. The slow and chaotic government response only made the heartbreak worse. Scenes from the Superdome and flooded streets were broadcast around the world, showing a major American city brought to its knees. Now the list only gets crazier. Off to number 10, 2008 Sichuan earthquake. May 12, 2008, started like any other day, until the ground roared to life in Sichuan province, China. A brutal 7.9 magnitude earthquake struck without mercy, flattening entire towns in minutes. Schools, homes and highways crumbled like they were made of paper. Over 87,000 lives were lost, and among them were thousands of schoolchildren, a tragedy that shook the whole nation to its core. Survivors scrambled through the wreckage with bare hands, desperate to find anyone still alive. The air was filled with dust, fear, and heartbreak. At number 11, 2024 Kerala Wayanad Landslide, India. On July 30th, 2024, disaster struck the serene hills of Wayanad, Kerala. After days of heavy, punishing rain, the saturated earth finally gave way, triggering a massive landslide that tore through villages without warning. Homes, farms and entire stretches of road vanished under walls of mud and debris. Dozens of lives were lost and hundreds were left homeless, staring in disbelief at the wreckage where their homes once stood. Rescue teams raced against time, battling rough terrain and constant rain, digging desperately for any signs of life. For the people of Wayanad, it wasn't just the loss of property. It was the heartbreak of seeing their land, their history, and their memories washed away. What was once a peaceful green paradise 
turned into a scene of devastation almost overnight. The 2024 Wayanad landslide was a brutal reminder of nature's unforgiving power. Imagine a day like any other, until the ground shakes and the ocean rises, turning calm shores into chaos for 14 countries. At number 12, 2004 Indian Ocean Tsunami. It was December 26, 2004, a day that would change the lives of millions forever. Without warning, a massive earthquake struck off the coast of Sumatra, unleashing a monstrous tsunami across the Indian Ocean. Countries like Indonesia, Sri Lanka, India and Thailand were hit hardest as waves as high as 30 meters slammed into coastlines, obliterating everything in their path. Entire communities were swept away in minutes and over 230,000 lives were lost. People who had no time to react found themselves fighting for survival against nature's unrelenting force. The sheer devastation left behind, destroyed homes, displaced families and entire towns submerged, was almost beyond comprehension. In the aftermath, the world came together, not just in grief, but in an effort to rebuild what had been lost. The 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami wasn't just an event, it was a global tragedy that no one will ever forget. At number 13, 2011 Japan Earthquake and Tsunami. On March 11, 2011, Japan was struck by one of the most powerful earthquakes ever recorded. A 9.0 magnitude quake rattled the country, shaking cities and towns along the eastern coastline to their core. But it wasn't just the ground that shook, the sea quickly followed, sending massive tsunami waves crashing onto the shores. Within minutes, entire communities were inundated as walls of water as high as 40 feet swept away everything in their path. The scenes were unimaginable. Homes, cars and even entire neighborhoods were washed away, leaving nothing but destruction. Over 18,000 people were killed, and the disaster triggered a nuclear crisis at the Fukushima Daiichi plant, adding even more heartbreak to the already catastrophic event. The 2011 Japan earthquake and tsunami wasn't just a tragedy. It was a moment that tested the resilience of a nation already known for its strength. But what do you do when the very land beneath your feet turns into a raging river in the blink of an eye? It's 2022 Pakistan floods. Monsoon rains, far heavier than usual, turned the country into a flood zone, displacing millions in an instant. Entire villages were submerged as rivers, lakes, and even roads overflowed, swallowing everything in their path. Over 1,700 lives were lost, and the country's already struggling infrastructure was pushed to the brink. The floods devastated crops, leaving farmers with nothing but ruined fields and a shattered livelihood. People found themselves trapped in their own homes, with no way to escape the rising waters. What do you do when you know the storm is coming, but nothing prepares you for the aftermath? That's what Florida faced in September 2022, when Hurricane Ian made landfall as a Category 4 beast. Last but not the least at number 15, it's 2022, Hurricane Ian in USA and Cuba. Hurricane Ian roared to life, leaving a trail of heartbreak across Cuba and the southeastern United States. It struck Cuba first, knocking out power to the entire island and devastating homes and farmland. But Ian wasn't done. It strengthened into a monstrous Category 4 storm before slamming into Florida. Communities like Fort Myers and Naples were almost unrecognizable after Ian's furious winds and massive storm surge drowned streets, tore apart buildings, and swept away anything in its path. Over 150 lives were lost, and damages soared into the billions. For many, survival meant clinging to rooftops, wading through chest-deep waters, and facing the terrifying unknown. Even after the skies cleared, the emotional and financial toll was crushing, Ian became one of the costliest and deadliest storms in recent US history, a painful reminder of nature's unforgiving power. Which of these do you think is the worst? Do you think climate change has a huge impact on the natural environment? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.